Welcome to Hedge Apple Acres. In today's video, we're going to talk about our week and a little bit about us. Hope you stay tuned. Let me go get the sheep some food and I'll be back. I got the sheep some feed so they're being quiet now. I'm sure each of you have experienced the week like we have had. A while back, the weather got too cold and cracked my PVC pipe. You can see on it a crack there and it's in the 90's cracked. So I've got to repair that. It's my own fault. I didn't drain the pipe when it was getting cold and then it got colder than what I expected. More work for me. Came home Wednesday, came out to check stuff. It was late, it was a cold day. And I came out here and Edna had babies. I didn't have Edna now, down for breeding them to kindle. So I didn't have a nest box or anything in. So I lost the babies because it was freezing weather. I had her down to kindle a week later. Also on Wednesday, I came out to video Thursday's vlog and my battery was dead in my camera. Thursday I come out to do the video and I record it. I do it all. I think it's it's great. It's probably my best work ever. I go into import it into iMovie and the audio is awful. I've ordered a uh, mic, external mic, and I've ordered a mic adapter for it. The mic has arrived, but the mic adapter has not. It will be here tomorrow. So that was out. So Friday, I come out, we're going to try it again. This time I use my new camera. I got a GoPro Hero 7 Black to try it with. And then I recorded audio on my iPhone. And I get in the house. And I, I'm able to sync the audio and video pretty good. So then... Saturday morning I go out and start chores and I have a couple videos I do then and I do the same thing audio on my phone video on the GoPro and I go in to sync it and I can't get the audio to sync with the video I've read there's some automatic ways but I was just trying to drag and drop not much success this week's been one of those weeks uh, on a good note CJ's old time farm invited us to do a collaboration and gave us a shout out and we greatly appreciate it. I'll put a link to her channel and I'll put a link in the description. Thanks CJ. Appreciate it greatly. To our new subscribers, welcome. A little bit about who we are. My wife and I are educators and we have what some would consider a hobby farm. I cringe at that term. We'll talk about it. I grew up on a dairy farm and we had chicken houses for a little while. I went to school for animal science. I have a bachelor's in animal science before I took my route into education. What we are attempting to do here is not so much homesteading, not so much permaculture, but just a small farm like my grandparents would have been raised on. Poultry to provide eggs, meat for the table, produce, and then our other animals, a diverse small farm. I cringe at the thought of someone calling it a hobby farm because I have animals that I expect to pay the bills. They're expected to make money. They don't have to make a lot, but I expect them to pay for themselves or provide a service to us. The livestock guardian dogs, they provide a service to us. The sheep should pay for their own food. They ought to pay for the livestock guardian dogs. Kiko goats, same way. The rabbits are going to provide meat for the table and a few to sell. I hope your week was better than ours. Um, if not, it's bound to get better. We thank you for watching, and as always, we encourage you to click like and subscribe. We'll be seeing you more.